my name is Hal Sherliff, and I am the coordinator for the John Burton Society in New England and a good chunk of Upper State New York. And it's uh, late Jan January of 2015, and this Article 5 issue is heating up. And I'd like to uh, uh, just call this short little video clip Mark Meckler makes a ca case against an Article 5 convention. Now, Mark Meckler is the founder of Convention of States Project. He is one of the leading supporters of an Article 5 convention. And he sends out emails a couple of week. And I received one not too long ago, probably was, right, I think, late December, early January. And in the email, he makes a case against an Article 5 convention. And I'll read it to you. The election of 2014 was amazing. Self-governance candidates, now self-governance candidates are those that he would support, uh, took control of the U.S. Senate and advanced a majority in the House. Plus the GOP, which is the Republican Party, now controls two-thirds of all state legislature chambers, the most since 1920. Now let's dwell on that. All of these people that are supposed to be supporting limited government, self-governance types, now have a pretty large majority at state houses and in Congress. So what's the solution? Simply start repealing all these laws and saying no to these laws that are enforcing, uh, giving us more government at the state level and at the federal level. Pretty simple, because we have so many of these people, right? That he goes on. But that can't make us complacent. Now it's time to lean into this momentum for real change. Well, he already admitted that we had real change. And he goes on to say, the solution is not electing better politicians and hoping that they do the right thing. Though that certainly helps. Well, he just said, we've elected better politicians, and they're self-governance types, so they're going to do the right thing. And according to Mark, real change is not going to happen by changing the players on the field. Really, Mark? We're going to have the same people prior to this election, maybe? A real change um, is not going to happen by changing the players in the field. I repeat that but by changing the rules of the game. So he's advocating, keep the same people, just change the rules. Now it is time to push for a convention of the states to restrain the government from overstepping its bounds. Well, the government won't overstep its bounds if we have all these self-governance types that are in the House, in the Senate, and at state houses all over the country, right, Mark? But no, we need to change the rules, he says. Well. They're telling us with a straight face, Mark Meckler and his supporters, that uh, they have nothing but the utmost respect for the founders. And in fact, this Article 5 uh, convention is one of the greatest things they ever gave us. But now they want to change the rules. Well, the rules that we had made it possible for these self-governance types to get elected. Now he wants to change that. So maybe they won't get elected. So uh, I, I submit to you that this uh, notion of an Article 5 convention is dangerous. It is um, ill-advised, Ill and it will lead to a changing of the rules. And Mark doesn't tell us exactly what rules they are. Their resolutions that they've introduced in numerous state houses are open-ended. And he doesn't tell us who's going to sit at these, this convention, what type of people, the caliber, what type of, um, who's going to appoint these delegates. We have no idea. Yet he's willing to chance all that. We are making progress. He admitted it. We are making progress. Self-governance types are getting elected all over the country. It's a great liberty movement. And there is no quick fix. So um, if you're interested in learning more about this issue, I suggest you go to jbs.org. And on Facebook, there's a, face there's a number of Facebook uh, groups that are updated with updated information. One of them is called Choose Freedom, Stop the Con Con. And there's another one called Stop the Constitutional Convention. Thank you very much. And anyone's interested in getting this email, um, I'll have contact information. Um, uh, Shirtlifthal at AOL.com is my email address. You can also find us on Facebook. I'll, I'll post this on the Facebook page, Stop the Constitutional Convention, as well. Thank you.